Hello Aquarius, so this is the reading I got for you guys for the mid-month of December. So I'm going to start with the Romance Angel first. Right. Universe, give me a four card spread. What messages do you have? I mean, what's going on with um, Aquarius of Life for December 15th to the 31st? So I got give a relationship a chance, okay? So somebody want to um, still work on this connection, okay? Um, your person still want to. Universe, can make them records. This one, okay. Religious factors. However, I feel like a lot of you guys are trying to maintain, um, maintain a certain treatment, or trying to um, level up when it comes to, um, yeah, when it comes to treatment, when it comes to standards. Because for me, religious factors represent like morals, principles. You know, so I feel like with your person, it's like you want them to put in more work, okay, um, to keep this connection going. Universe, give me two more cards. What, um, what's going on with prayer soap life? For yourself, okay? A lot of you guys do want to kind of disconnect, okay? Your person, though, want you to be more open with them. Universe, give me one more card. I got two cards. I got forgiving and learning and calling your cellmate. Yeah, so it's like your person want them, your person want you to forgive them. You want them to just meet you at your level. And I feel like there is going to be a common ground, okay, between you guys. At the bottom of the deck, I got a safe free to love. Yeah, so I feel like there is going to be a common ground, especially the last two weeks of December, especially during the holiday season. I feel like they are going to compromise. They're going to try to make things better with you, okay? So I'm getting... Fire, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Okay. I also got Gemini. I got, I already said Aries. Could be another Aquarius. Okay. Earth sign towards Virgo Capricorn. Universe, give me a five card spread. What's going on with the card itself? I'm December 15 to the 31st, 2020. King of Wands and the Seven of Cups. Wow. Okay. So someone is determined to make things right with you. Okay. It's like abracadabra. <laughs> they trying to, yeah, I feel like they trying to meet you. They trying to go over and above your expectation. Okay. Which is good. Universe, give me four more cards. What's going on with Aquarius Sub Live, December the 15th to the 31st. So I got the nine of cups and six of swords. Yeah, I feel like they are going to try to meet you at your level because they kind of feel like the distance between you and them or they feel like you are going to move on, <laughs> okay? So I feel like they are determined to have you. So I'm getting Aries. I'm also getting Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, but strong Aries, Pisces. This person could be a Pisces, Aries, Cups. Universe, give me three more cards. Um, what's going on with Aquarius Love Life? December the 15th, Six of Pentacles, Universe. Yeah, because I feel like before it was one-sided, and I feel like right now they are trying to make things right, basically. Universe, give me two more cards. What's going on with Aquarius Love Life? So, I got the Strength card. Yeah, you are their rock. And they want you to continue to be in this connection, okay? They want this connection to still be strong. Universe, give me one more card. What's going on with Aquarius Love Life, December the 15th? Okay. So I got the Ace of Pentacles and the King of Pentacles. Yep, they want things to be stable with you. Do expect a beautiful gift. Um, this cards, these cards want to show itself to you. Um, they want to continue to invest in you. Okay, invest in the connection. At the bottom of the deck, the Nine of Pentacles. Ooh. Yeah, because I feel like a lot of you guys have detached from this person. You have. I'm emotionally detached. Probably you guys have physically broken up with this person too. But I'm not really getting that. I feel like. Because of you creating new standards, new boundaries, I feel like they're definitely going to match your expectation or go above your expectation. I definitely see them trying to make things more stable and right with you. I'm seeing a major gift, okay? They might buy a home um, for you. I'm seeing something where you're going to feel really comfortable. You're going to be feeling like the grand madame, <laughs> okay? Um, you're going to be feeling like You'll be feeling good, okay? So I definitely see they're determined to make things right with you. So that's good. Universe, cut for the Nine of Pentacles. Universe, cut for the Nine of Pentacles. Six of Wands. Yeah, they try, they determine. 
They want this to be successful. Universe Cup Five Six of Wands. 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 Universe the Hermit. Okay. Yeah, they was really thinking about what to make you happy. They was hearing your conversation. They was listening to the intuition. And I feel like now they say, Let me let me let me prove my prove my point of of the determination of having you. And that's what I'm seeing. Like they are trying to show you that they deserve you, okay? Universe card five, the the hermit. Universe card five, the hermit. Ace of Cups. Yep, they have love for you. And they're gonna show you that. Universe card for the King of Pentacles and Ace of Pentacles. Universe card for the King of Pentacles and Ace of Pentacles. Universe card for the King of Pentacles and Ace of Pentacles. Universe card for the King of Pentacles and Ace of Pentacles. Universe card for the King of Pentacles and Ace of Pentacles. Nine of Pentacles. It took a journey. It took some time. Okay. They definitely felt distant from you. They missed that. That they missed your attention. Okay. But they want to start something completely new with you. Universe card for the strength card. Universe. Okay. Two of Wands. They definitely see you in their future. Okay. Even though they had some disagreements. Okay. Universe card for the Six of Pentacles in reverse. Universe card for the Six of Pentacles in reverse. Universe card for the Six of Pentacles in reverse. Yep. They're trying to change. Magician is about change. It's kind of like the Wheel of Fortune. Universe card five. Yeah, they're changing because they see that you're not giving to the situation anymore. Universe clarify the Knight of Cups and the Six of Swords. Universe clarify the Knight of Cups and the Six of Swords. Universe clarify the Knight of Cups and the Six of Swords. Universe clarify the Knight of Cups and the Six of Swords. Universe clarify the Knight of Cups and the Six of Swords. Universe clarify the Knight of Cups and Six of Swords. So I got the Empress in reverse. Yeah, you start, you stop giving to the situation. And I feel like now they're pulling their weight, okay? A lot of you guys was just tired. And now they have the energy to just pull their weight. Universe cover the inference in reverse. Yep. They're going to pull their weight. I see financially they're going to pull their weight and emotionally and energetically putting more energy into the connection. Universe cover the king of wands and the seven of cups. The devil and the page of cups. Okay, so, yeah, they're determined. So that's the first message I got for these two cards was this, they, they, they determined to do whatever. And I'm seeing that. They're going to try different aspects, I mean, doing different things to see how can they make the connection better. And I'm obsessively trying to do that, okay? Because there probably was a disagreement, a disconnect, and they want this connection to still be in union. So the signs, Pisces, strongly, Aries, um, Capricorn, Leo, Virgo, um, yeah, Aries, Aries, um, that's what I'm really getting. Universe, give me a four cards, but what messages do you have for Aquarius between today, love life, December? Okay, so I got truth. Yeah, I feel like you guys spoke the truth of what you want in this connection, what you need, and I feel like they are gonna match that. Okay, universe, give me three my cards. What messages do you have for Aquarius? Okay, I got a lot of cards. Okay, so I got trump of success. I feel like, yes, they're definitely gonna meet your expectation. Shadow, um, I feel like they had to handle certain things within their own self, okay? And solitude, yeah, within their own self while you're doing the same thing as well. And then I also got, I got authority, base chakra, and rejoice celebration. So the rejoice and celebration is the three cups. So I see, I still see you guys are going to be together. I make things right. Um, just starting a brand new beginning when it comes to having a solid foundation. And I feel like this person is going to definitely reroute and make things better with the authority card being there. Putting the groundwork in a much better position, okay? Now, at the bottom of the deck, 
I got Patrick Knighted. That's what I'm getting. I feel like the passion is going to be restored. Okay. Universe, give me a three card spread. Let's just, okay. So I got full moon surrounded to the divine. So a lot of you guys did, you know, put that above you. <laughs> okay. Um, you let go and let God. Universe, give me two more cards. What messages do you have? Okay, a lot of cards. So, I got Gibeous Moon. You, you're very close to achieving your goal. And I feel like it's more with, you know, when it comes to love. Like, I feel like this person is going to meet you at the way that you want to be treated. And then I got First Quarter Moon. Your commitment is being tested. A lot of you guys was thinking of giving up. But I feel like this, this passion is going to be restored where you don't want to give up on this person because now they're finally putting their weight. And I got New Moon and Leo. Confidence is your key to success. Yeah. So, I feel like things are getting better. Um, you're more confident in the relationship or will be. And I got full moon Gemini. The answers you need are coming. Okay. And I feel like this is more like you're going to see things. You're going to see things are improving. All right. Universe, give me a four card spread. What much do you have for Aquarius? So I got helpful people. Universe, give me two more cards. I got perfect timing. Give me two more cards. What's just you have? Okay. The situation improved. Look for a sign. Okay. Give me one more card. Okay. There's something better. And abundance. And at the bottom of the deck, I got improving health. So I keep on getting things will improve. So I feel like you and your person will get better, like the connection will get better. It's going to be really at the right time where you really thought you're going to be moving on from this connection. I've seen that's when they're actually going to put in the work. Now, what there's something better in abundance, okay? Some of you, Aquarius, um, may feel like, okay, this person's really not aligned to me and I'm going to pursue what is better for me, okay? And I'm seeing that that is a possibility for you guys too, Um but the main energy I was picking up from this whole spreads um, is basically someone is meeting you at where they should meet you, okay? And some of them are going out and, uh, out and above, okay, of what you expected from them. And I've seen that they are trying to really make things work with you. Universe, give me two cards. Five more messages you have. Okay. Too many cards. Universe, give me two cards. Five more messages you have for Aquarius. So, I got the unknown. I bow to the infinite intelligence of the cosmos, and my next steps are revealed. So, yeah, like a lot of you guys are not too, you know, sure if things will get better, if they will put in their weight. But I feel like because of you not knowing and because of you focusing on yourself and not dwelling on it so much they're pe they picking it up like you know you're kind of over it and it's like they're gonna step up to the plate okay universe give me one my card okay so i got two cards i got the power of support and creative cocooning i'm grateful for all the love and support i receive it's the most precious of life's gifts so i feel like yeah they finally are going to put in their weight they're going to be more supportive either emotionally supportive financially supportive I feel like they are going to put in their weight. And with creative cocooning, creative cocooning is a freedom I give myself. I create a safe nest for peace, healing, and calm. So I feel like at the same time, while they're doing this, you're going to be focusing on yourself, okay? You're not going to be too caught up, you know, when you're going to do it. I feel like you're just going to be focusing on yourself. And that soul's journey, living from the soul's open me to the magic that exists when I surrender to the divine manifestation on its own term and timing. Yeah, I feel like you're not going to, you know, sit and like weight is like you're focusing on yourself you're trying to improve yourself and because of that they seeing that they want to give to the situation okay so that's the reading that i got for you aquarius thank you guys for watching my video and subscribing if this video resonates you can definitely book a personal reading with me at queen for the tarot at gmail.com